today, I might get to stand at the crater's edge of the most destructive volcano in human history, Krakatoa. The current eruptive activity is actually rebuilding Krakatoa, but when it had its cataclysmic eruption, it released more energy than 13,000 Hiroshima bombs and was the loudest sound ever recorded in history. As we approach this extremely active volcano, it gives us a spectacular show. Huge ash clouds rise hundreds of meters in the air. That's what I came to see. Now it's time to get on the island and try to get really close to the top of the cone. This is gonna be tough determining how close is safe on this one. Oh, this is loose stuff to walk in. Oh, here we go. So the idea right now is to see how far up the mountain I can get before the rocks start raining down. When you see that coming down the side of the mountain towards you, that's when you gotta run. Not that it's gonna help. Looks like we can go a little bit higher up. A little higher? Yeah, go. All right. <laughs> now notice Donnie my volcanologist friend here, he's way down there while I'm up here. What's with that? What's that, no further up? <laughs> <laughs> Donnie's commenting. <coughs> oh, ash. That Kilauea is a piece of cake. Well, Kilauea doesn't throw rocks at you like this one does. Kilauea, you have to work hard to get killed. Here, it's easy. <laughs> I like this mountain. Well, it's starting to get late in the day. The sun's gonna be going down soon enough, so it's best to just get off the mountain, go and observe from a safer area because when it starts getting dark and these things start heading for you, <laughs> game over, man. Krakatoa is a fascinating site. It's been on my list for years, but it's by no means the only dangerous volcano here. Mm -hmm. 